Does Mountain Dew taste better in Japan? Let's talk about that. Good mythical morning. Foreigners have not been shy about passing judgment on what we eat and our standards for food here in the US, okay? Uh -huh. For example, a lot of Europeans like to claim our American chocolate tastes like barf. Yeah, well, how do you guys know what barf tastes like, huh? <laughs> <laughs> got him! Uh, we're not saying we got the best tasting version of everything, but I will say there's plenty of American snacks that other lands have adapted for their own palate. Uh huh, that is so true saying. that we can prove it. Today we're gonna be trying foreign versions of familiar snacks and seeing if we can tell the difference. It's time for Same Munchy, Different Country Snacks Edition, part three. As you can see, we can't. But why can't we see? Why are we blindfolded, Stevie? Because it's easier to pull things over on you when you can't see what oh, we're doing. Oh, no. Like also, the covers? Is it bedtime? <laughs> yeah, it's easier to pull the covers over you. Yeah, yeah, that's how Link goes to bed every night. They, blind, they blindfold him and then they tuck him in. <laughs> yeah, they... <laughs> And Christy's like, hush, hush. It's, it's the only way she can get him to calm down and stop talking. Okay, you're going to be tasting versions of the same snack from different countries and seeing if you can identify the American version by taste. The winner will get compliments from the loser that were written in English, Google translated into another language, and then translated back into English and Good Mythical More. Whoop. And you're blindfolded because some of these, you know, they look a little bit different and we don't want to give you any hints. And up first, you've got Lay's sour cream and onion chips. Ooh, Ooh we know those we like are so these. good. All right, I let's put a wager on this. How how confident are you? Two chips that you can pick the American one. Two chips worth. Two chips worth. Uh, I right. don't know, man. I, some, I'm a five chip. I wager. have I have found that confidence doesn't always help with these games because it's like, oh yeah, this seems like it's gonna be easy, but then and where's the other one from? Thailand. 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 Hmm. Thailand. That's a good chip. Hey. I made a mistake right before this. Oh, man. You know what I did? You didn't wash your hands after you pee peed, and you just tasted a little. <laughs> you just tasted a little pee pee, and it's messing everything up. Oh, no, <laughs> dude. I, I, uh, I gargled. Well, one is much stronger than the other. Well, they, they're definitely. Is that how they're different? One of them seems sweeter. What about texture-wise? Because visually, it, one of them is harder. Okay, yeah, that's like, what it, it looks like. One of them's harder. They're good. They're both good. I'm gonna have to get Lick Daddy on this. And we're trying to figure out which one's from the U.S. Yep. Where are we from? I just got to eat a whole lot of these to cover up my gargle. I gotta like make my breath bad on purpose. I gotta say I'm thoroughly confused, but it, I, it it it's tough. Nicely, three, two, one. Ha! There we go. Okay, you can take your blindfolds off. Yeah. Well, thank you for that. Oh, I think you we're feel right. different. Oh gosh, they're brown, homie. They're yeah, like the, the same color American as your shirt. chips are on link side. Oh really? <laughs> yeah. Even That's what American them. chips look like. What? I just don't. I'm not, I don't really look at food. I just eat it. Do we have any facts about why these are better? Are they so different. The in Thailand, Thailand version's better. It's processed with rice bran oil, oh, that's which can reduce saturated fat by fifty percent. It has no preservatives, and oh, has less seasoning. I don't know. I don't know if that adds up necessarily, but. It does to me because I, I don't think they taste nearly as good now that I've gotten rid of my fresh breath. Wow, you think and the, it has less seasoning? Thing, and the consistency, it, they're just, they're too thick for me. I agree the consistency of the American version is better. And I kind of feel like the Thailand chip, the first one was really good and the more and more I eat, the, this flavor actually gets a little bit off-putting. Yeah, been there, done that. Hmm. Well, we were wrong though. No, I wasn't. Yes, I was. Yeah. You know what? I did. I I voted for the wrong one. Good. Good. Why? Good. It, why did it take me this long to realize? What? I. I meant to vote for this one. 
Okay. All right, fine, whatever. Zero okay. to zero, but I knew, I, Good. I was voting for Thailand. Okay. <laughs> Keep doing that. Keep it up. All right, up next we have Trolley Sour Bright Crawlers. And up there you've got Sour one from bright. the US, you've got one from Germany, and you've got one from Australia. Okay, we decided in Australia. Uh, to take the blindfolds off. There is a difference in these. Oh, yeah. But um, none of, we don't buy these. So, but I think you, that but you're a lover of these of of sour I'll eat um, them if people gummies. give them to me but, but you don't I, buy them. I don't I don't even really get these at the movie theater. I mean like which this, one feels more American? This Two one color is or three four color. Pink and blue, pink and blue. This was just pink and blue and then this one is just pink and blue but, but then, squiggly. But then there's also pink and yellow and then oh, there's Oh, I've got pink and yellow here. Green too. and so it's just Actually, these are also the yellow too. There's yellow and pink in these too. They are, okay, oh, yeah. and there's also well, orange I'm, and green. I'm gonna taste the same ones out of all these, so I'm going with the pink and blue. And I know that I'm voting for the US this time. I don't know how I got confused. I was just, you gotta say that more confidently, really. Okay. I know! There's something pretty distinctive in that first one, but I'm not gonna tell you what it is. Those worms are smaller. Well, They're, it's like these stretch. Their diameter. Hold one of these. Mm -hmm. I'm going to stretch this one and see if it ends up being the same. Nope. Nope. It didn't. Oh, look at that. It is. It, so this is more volume. It's also softer. Mm hmm. A lot softer. And a different, a totally different fruit profile. Not as sour. And then the squiggly fatty over here. Um, boy, they. What? Why are they so different? It's they just... took the time to squiggle these. That one's very sour. And then a, a completely different, another fruit profile. Mm hmm All the same company? Yeah, they're all trolley. What do they do? How do they do this? Do they? I guess they're sourcing ingredients more locally? I don't know if, no, if, they, they have, if there's different plants. They think that the people who live in this country like squiggly more than the people who work, work and live in this country. And these people like four colors instead of two colors. Like This is like market research, man. I'm fairly confident based on flavor profile, texture, and sour level. I'm trying to go with which one's the most sour. Three, two, one. Why did you vote for that one? Because I think that bigger, softer, and I think it has a more um, nostalgic fruit profile. That's my vote. So Link, you thought the ones that you stabbed were the sourest, that's why you stabbed Yeah, them? yeah, that's what I was thinking. Is that what you thought, Rhett, that those were the sourest? They are the sourest. Okay. Uh, the American gummies are in the middle. Woo! You did it, Rhett. The other ones on Rhett's side is the Australian version. They like it sour. On Link's side is the German version. Sour. And, um, the Mythical Crew actually thought that the American version was the most sour, so it's interesting that y'all both chose the Australian version. The The main ingredient difference These is that the German version is made with potato starch, the American is made with corn starch, and Australian has no starch. No starch? Is that what makes them smaller, I guess? Well, what do they do? What do you do without starch? You, I think you do just fine. I liked them. And they are, I think they are the best. As you can see, we can again. Huh. Okay, this is going to be an interesting round for multiple reasons because you have four glasses of Mountain Dew in front of you from four different countries. You have one straw each, uh -huh. and you're going to need to go down the line with the single straw that you have and put it in each of the glasses to guess uh, the Mountain Dew from the U.S. Oh. This is like a 50s soda shop. Oh, lady. good law. Now... Just two boys in the 50s drinking out of the same drink. Well. <laughs> well. Is this it? That's it, man. Is this it? That's it, man. Is that it? What country did you say? Uh, the UK, New Zealand, Japan, and the US. The UK, New Zealand, Japan, I thought it was a bottle. That's my hand. Am I in? Hey, whoa, whoa. 
That one's not as good. Tastes like soap. <sighs> yeah, why is it? I'm, I feel like I'm breathing hard too. You're both being so um, respectful and nice. Yeah, yeah. Like well, you always are. Of Rhett, course. Rhett whispered to me, "Don't spill anything on my Paddington shirt." Yeah, yeah. I did say that. Also, uh, we've been taking an etiquette class. <laughs> did you not know? That's where we've been on Thursdays. That's why you can't get in touch with us. <laughs> we gotta get ready for our quinceanera. <laughs> Maybe I just don't like Mountain Dew. I think I don't. That's strange. I think I've established that on this show, actually. Um, We're male uh, yellow boys. I don't know why my leg is still underneath you. Where is the drink? No, no, you gotta go farther. Gotta go farther. Let me use some etiquette to help you. Don't grab my straw. Well, I was you. Ow! Don't grab my straw. <laughs> now remember the etiquette class. I'm also just realizing red straws just upside down. <laughs> it still works. Yeah, it is. When I grabbed it, I felt I felt the joint in it. Oh, it's jointed. Yeah. Don't, hey, don't squeeze what? it. Why well, do you I, touch my straw I, I so much, man? I wasn't squeezing it. Let go of my straw. <laughs> this is quiet time. <laughs> uh, okay, get, I got oh, okay, okay, you're about to, you're... Uh, uh, I gotta get that. Uh, Oh. Wait. What are you doing, bro? Okay. Are you ready? Not, not quite. <laughs> I don't know, man. I feel stupid. Okay. Ready? Three, two. One. Are you, are you? Not confident, man. Okay. You're in, man. Are you, are you in? Yeah, 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 yeah. I'm in a different one. Oh, good. Okay, good. But I, I'm pretty confident. I, could, well, I can look at the colors and tell you that it's definitely one of these two. Look I, how, look we how, kept going back here because. Look how like. Greeny, green. It's definitely are. not that one. You're these wrong. These are yellow. Dude. You're wrong. I'm all over this. Well, the it first time I, the first time I tasted this one, I was like, "That's definitely not Mountain Dew." But then I, I, got, I confused myself more. <laughs> Eventually, I was like, "Maybe that is Mountain Dew." The American Mountain Dew is in glass number two. Yeah. Ah! Really? Yeah. Yeah. So. Uh, Hold on. So you're right. Why are you upset? Oh, I thought that was like a oh. celebration grunt. So that was an anger? What is wrong with you, man? <laughs> well, I just gotta tell you, I thought I was over here. <laughs> I thought I was in the... What, every time I was going back, was I tasting this one? I don't even know how to answer that question. Well, I was tasting that one the when I was going back, The last time, right? the big physical tumble, you were tasting the one that you voted for. But I thought it was the farthest one. Oh, and okay. then I thought I was voting for the farthest one, but I was voting for the one I was tasting. So here, we hold on. So are we okay? This is the hardest thing I've ever done, guys. I mean, it's Why not is as this hard so as you're difficult? making it seem. Do you want to taste it now that your blindfold is on? No, I, I want to taste it. I, I did. I want to taste it. The second one, Rhett, you were like, Ugh, when you tasted it, and this is the U.S. version. Yeah, because I don't like Mountain Dew. That's that. that I'm just confirming that I don't. <laughs> and in fact. It's my least favorite of all of these. What's the difference? So we have the, cans? the one Rhett voted for is from New Zealand, oh. then the US, oh. then Japan, then the UK. That's the order. And the US formula cannot legally be sold in the UK because it has restrictions on high fructose corn syrup. Oh, yeah. Sure. And then Japan and UK versions have no artificial color, so that's why you can really see that difference. Yeah, it mm. might be hard to see on camera, but here in person. This is very tepid. It, it looks like urine. 
And then the US and the New Zealand versions both have orange juice listed in the ingredients in the UK and Japan. I learned don't. that recently. It's interesting that the Jap Japanese one, uh, they still spell it in English because I guess it's such a well-known brand. It's still Mountain Dew, bro. Yeah. Hey, Rhett, look at this sweatshirt. You see it? Describe it. It's beautiful. Yeah. What color is it? Um, I mean, I, you know, I don't think I could really put a label on it. Does it have embroidery? Oh, yes. Yeah. Yes, it is. You know what it's called? The Mythical Vacation Sweatshirt. Why? <laughs> well, I don't, Stevie, why is it called the Mythical Vacation Sweatshirt? Well, because it was originally called the Winter Vacation Sweatshirt. When it, it was, was in green. green. And it was so popular oh. that we had to bring it back for all year round vacation. This is the best feeling sweatshirt and everyone would love the green one. Everyone in my family got one back in Christmas and now I'm gonna have to get them the blue one and the gray one. Oh so, my goodness. Uh, grab a blue one, a gray one, or a green one. Complete the collection. Over at mythical.com. This is nice. That's embroidery. This is like, it feels good. Hey, it looks we, good. Did we mention that it's embroidery? It tastes good. All right, we're ending things today with a little dessert. You have Chips Ahoy cookies in front of you. Oh. One from the US, one from China. You, you would think that we would be able to know the difference here. Well, it's not the chewy version. Mm -hmm. Chewy Chips Ahoy. Who likes those? Me kinda. Do you kinda? I believe in us. <laughs> we're tied, man. Mm-hmm. One of them's taller than the other one. Yep, one of them's taller, one of them's shorter. I'm gonna keep these for myself. All right, I gotta tell you, even with no blindfold, even with a blindfold, this is gonna be easy, but. Three. Two. But. <laughs> I'm always confused at this game, so. Are you gonna count down? One. Ow. Tried to fake you out, man. No, this is definitely, yeah, you're, you're, you're right. Yep, there you go. Yeah. This we, was easy. We, we thought this one was gonna be a little bit easier. So the one on Rhett's side's from China, the one on Link's side is from the US. Yeah. We make we, we do things bigger here. But let's 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 analyze the taste difference here. Um the chocolate is different. It's even crispier than the already what some people might think is too crispy. Like crumbly? It's too crumbly. It doesn't it doesn't taste nearly as good. The the cookie part of it is not You know, I bet you'd be good with milk though. So it probably it's, it's airier, milk. yeah. It's probably because the US version has canola oil, palm oil, high fructose corn syrup, and the Chinese version does not have any of those. You need things. those three things. Yeah. So that means we're still tied. So um Well, I, there's a lot of translated compliments to go around and good mystical more, and I, I'd like to hear all of them. Yeah, like you I, know, I, I kinda think... I should if I wasn't so dumb. I would have had that point from the chips in round one. You know what, you're, you're, you're completely right that you knew which one was the right version. But I didn't deserve. But when you call timeout and there's you don't have any more timeouts, you still get a technical foul. Yeah, and you, I didn't deserve the point you're, from Mountain You're Dew. sort of like the Chris Webber of this show. Sports joke. <laughs> <laughs> Thanks for subscribing and clicking that bell. You know what time it is. Hi, my name is Aubrey. I'm Clark. I'm Logan. And I'm Gary. We're from Kelso, Washington. And we're eating exotic foods from different countries. And, and it's time, time to spin the wheel of physicality. Who's the Darren in your friend group? <laughs> <laughs> Who's the Clark? Like the little kid with a huge freaking beard. <laughs> All right, click the top link to watch us discover which American snacks are banned around the world and why in Good Mythical More. And to find out where the wheel of mythicality is going to land. Take a never ending trip with our mythical vacation sweatshirt available in two new colorways at mythical.com.